This is Ninja Gaiden Sigma. Um, your pal Slow Beef. I um, picked up this game at a used game store. Uh, I played Ninja Gaiden, obviously the old NES games. I played the uh, Xbox version and all that fun stuff. Sigma is something I was kind of interested in, so check it out. Um, you'll notice it starts with a big warning that you can't do anything with it. Okay, can I skip this? Or, no? All right. Do Master Ninja mode. Um, Master Ninja is very hard, apparently. Come on. Thank you. Okay. That's a 60 FPS uh, movie if I ever saw one. All right, Sigma. Let's see what you got. <laughs> Is that warning again? So let's do a new game. Looks good so far. <laughs> there we go. While we're loading, let's read about the Book of Fiends. Um, let's see. So. They are capturing the Vigor army, which are the bad guys in this, are capturing the territory of Gurdu. Nothing else. This is all otherwise just generic flavor text. Okay, is Neo related to this by the devs at all? Actually, it is. This is Team Ninja who made this. And Neo. I'm Ryu Hayabusa. How are we doing? Hey, look who it is. So maybe a tutorial would have been okay. All right, looks like left shoulder. Yeah, all right, thanks Ryu. He has terrible holes in the defense. All right, so camera and stick are kind of what you think they are. Square seems like regular attack. Triangle is heavy attack. Looks like you can charge it. It's been a long time since I played this. I do remember you could do that. Circle is, yeah, your projectiles. X is jump. R1 recenters the camera. I don't know what L2 and R2 do. Wait. Ooh. All right, what's your spiritual life as your potion of the game? Jeez, camera is. Pretty crummy. Where did you throw that ion? Oh, spoilers. There we go. A ninja must be able to find his way. Oh, why did they voice act this? When facing an obstacle. Jump towards it and run vertically up its yeah. side. Alright, let's that's let's spare everyone that. Oh wait now. Hey, 
Use the R3 button to enter first person. Oof. Wait, okay, so R3 and the right stick then. Dude, I got it, okay. Oops. Ooh. Jeez. This camera is awful. I don't. Yeah, alright, so. not underestimate the agility that your training has given you. Feats such as running away. Thank you, Ayane. If you don't know Ayane, she is from the Dead or Alive series, which is another Team Ninja game. Now, Ninja Gaiden is, of course, a Tecmo property, and I'm assuming Team Ninja is named for this one. one. Of your most useful techniques. Yeah, alright, I know this one. I know about the flying bird jump. Thank you. Hmm. Trolls are weird. Uh, this is an enhanced version of Ninja Gaiden Black. That's true. After Ninja Gaiden, they made Ninja Gaiden Black, and this is Sigma. Stop throwing shuriken at me. Oh, hello. I don't really know how I hit that guy there, but... Deflect your opponent's attacks by holding. Yeah, I figured that, Ayane. I figured that. So if you're w wondering what we're doing, I'm in training. Which means, like a dickhead, Ryu is killing, like, trainee ninjas just so he can, like, kind of fuck around. Huh? Wait, what? took a hit. But really, like, I don't understand, like, if you come here, how do you train if you're not Ryu Hayabusa? Like, where do you learn stuff? Like, oh, I want to learn how to be a ninja. Hey, you might, you might die training Ryu, and it's like, well, he's already, like, this incredible ninja, I thought. It's like, yeah, he is, but yeah, you gotta train. It's like, well, how does anyone... Actually, how are there any uh, ninjas who are not Ryu Hayabusa? Never pass the Junin exam at this... You'll never take the Junin exam at this rate, whatever that is. I don't even know how I did that move. Oh, hey now. Sigma 2, the one where they took the blood out? <laughs> what? Come on. Why would you take the blood out of this game? It's all like gory crap. Whoa. It looks like I can't really dodge until I stop blocking. Alright, I guess I'm doing okay. 
Okay. I feel like... Uh, part of the haste plate's missing. I feel like there's way more potions than they gave you in the original version of this. Raise my max HP. Look at that one on the left. I'm just fucking scared. He's just like waiting for his friends to handle all this stuff, and then look at that cheap shot from behind. You're the only one I don't feel that bad about, guy. Alright, let's see here. Fly at high speed while jumping. Hit triangle. Jumping toward an enemy, hit triangle. Wait, wait, wait. What was that last part? Tetsu. Uh, oh my god. Square triangle. Okay. I don't have that weapon yet. <sighs> uh oh, a white ninja. I don't know. A white ninja, I think, probably survived to the next level of training. Maybe by just being absent the day I needed to train. Move game. Bats? Really? I killed like a thousand, like a hundred ninja students, and then bats? Come on. Right, we got Fangs of the Samurai, which is an item that we needed. Is it funny? I don't know, it was what funny. Bats are a classic enemy. Yeah, this game does not have eagles in it, though. I'm gonna warn you all now. Alright, what do you want, Ayane? Use right and left on the directional button to select. Got it. That's the flying swallow move or whatever. This is the one with the flying ghost fish enemies. That's like end game stuff, I think. All right, so I guess this is part of my training too, where I fix the samurai statue. I don't understand why Ryu incorporates kicks into his sword combo. Like, that's kind of ridiculous to me. But, you know, whatever, I suppose. This camera looks like it's the worst. It's not great. <laughs>
now ninjas in. What? I totally meant to do that cool looking thing, by the way. Wow, this guy is pretty good. I mean, you know, maybe we could have used him instead of just have him murdered as fodder for my training, but whatever, I guess. I will say when he's alone, they're not wonderful. How did I get um, HP back? I wonder. Alright, let's get around that. Uh, okay. Yeah, I saw the word record. We know what that is. Yep. Happy birthday, Ryblarg. I'm seeing someone say. Um. Damn. It's almost like... It really does look like I have some idea of what I'm doing. But I'm just going to reveal to you I know. So the blue essence heals you. That's how that's going to go. What, Ayane? She's going to hit me with one of these. Tilt the left stick to roll your body. This is called the reverse wind take. Got it. Oh, they have shuriken, huh? Oh, hey now. This camera's not wonderful. Dick! That was like my ankle. Like you all to meet Mirai. Mirai is about where Ninja Gaiden stops fucking around. So this guy...
Well, anyway, that's our sparring done. Dragon sword. So your father is still in the sacred wilderness. What? Yes. He has entrusted me with the sword while he continues his training. I've never told you this before, Marai. I'm satisfied with the power he wields. Someday you will come to understand the pursuit of power. Perhaps beginning with your training here. And what are the sister blades? Oh, I killed like 60 of your guys coming in, by the way. It, as well? it remains in the village under the protection of my father's oh. clan. They will ensure that the sword remains untouched. Its dark power sealed. It is a shame that such a sword must go untouched. Mm -hmm. Such power unused. Alas, I am not of the dragon lineage. The sword is not of my concern. Then why did you fucking ask me about it? Maybe it's just small talk. Like, yeah. Sword, huh? What's going on? Let's see if we're interrupted by anyone. Uh-oh. The village I was just talking about? The one that housed the sister blade with my father's clan? What a coincidence. Let's see. Chapter 1 was cleared. 200,000 karma, I guess. Whatever that means. Just proceeding. Hey, alright. I thought they would dock me for using healing items, but... village is burning. Alright. You got it. Thanks. Thanks for the training. I'm sure beating the shit out of me with a goddamn fucking nunchuck. DBS is right there. Thank you for using all my healing items and not helping me out when my village is in trouble. Later, nunchucks. Did that mean I... I hope that wasn't serious, like, because... I forget. I don't think you get nunchucks from him, but you do get them. All right, Ryu, you're pissing me off. Thank you. <laughs> Raxus says, your village burning is only the next step in your training to become a master ninja. This door was blocked before, so... That's another thing too, you can trade your, uh, you can like, instead of absorbing those things and cash, they're kind of like the game's currency, but instead of using like that, you can also like, use your charge to pull them in and instantly get some awesome stuff. Wait, wait, wait. You can't fool me, game. Ryu, just grab the ledge like you did before, please. Right. 
I beat this game years ago. No, actually, no, I'm sorry, not this game. The original, the Ninja Gaiden, not Sigma or anything like that. Hey, what the hell is this? It's guard breaking fucking samurai, huh? I just think you guys would be doing the opposite in Neo years later. second game that you fight a, fight a giant Buddha statue in like the first level. I think. Oh dear. Hey. That's how you fucking do. These look less like samurai, more like guys are like contact sport kind of things. Maybe ninja fighting is like an extreme thing, like base jumping in this universe. What? Yes, I was running across water. Thank you for asking. That is a thing you can do in this game. As long as Ryu does not stop moving, he will, in fact, run across water. And if he stops, he does swim in it. From what I remember, yes, this game has swimming, like, swimming levels and shit like that, and they're not good. Because... the hell are you do? You're not done, man. The guy's like, yep, my work's done here. I think I cut him once and he's gonna go away, right? Like, I killed trainees. You guys are fucked. Yeah, see, you like that. That was just me holding triangle a little longer than I expected to. understand combat in this quite yet. Oh, I was gonna say that guy's fucked. But he's not apparently. Alright. did all this for a goddamn treasure chest of, oh, a map of my own village that I live in. I'm sure some of you are saying, so this is another game, another period piece game like Neo. Not quite. I'm just going to say that. That earns you a big ass not quite. Let's save, why not? Memorizing combos, Al 10K says, is more important in a game like this than like <gasps> EMC. Okay, so. In the good old Hayabusa village. I live here, the town's named after me. Well, to be totally fair, he had so many gaps in his defense, he'd never would have lived. Hmm. Bad news is, these guys know magic. Ah. 
How many of these guys are there to flip? There. And I am going to be so happy to kill you, magician dude. That's his name. Son. Wait, if there's two of you? That's kind of... <laughs> that's like a way a ninja calls somebody a nerd is when he just runs on their head like that. Alright, whatever. I guess we're done with this part. I knew it. I would have thought my clan could have taken care of this a little better than they did, but I guess not. Ayane, oh no. How are you going to be in the next Dead or Alive game? Or the movie, or the volleyball, or something? Dark <laughs> Only a game of volleyball could heal me now, Ryu. She had some serious gaps in her defense side, I have to say that. Um, wait, right, how do I equip the bow? Let's see. Let's have that on it. Okay, let's not. It's a waste of an arrow, but got it. Don't attempt to fight it with this bow I'm giving you. Ah, now you're probably wondering what's this statue about? Muramasa, the blacksmith. So you can trade your shit in. Right, he can't fix that. Let's forget about that for now, because we can also. Look how pensive the game gotten. What were his last thoughts as he slipped off into the darkness? You don't care. Alright, that heals our Ninpo. Ryu is very fast, which is cool, but he's is, he is kind of hard to control. Like, I can't jump out of that combo, which I think is kind of nonsense. I mean, I am a fucking ninja, but... There. Um, wasn't this game about blocks and counters? I don't know. I don't know. It's been, it's been a bit since I played it, admittedly. Let's talk to our... <sighs> what a dick! So... <laughs> oh yeah, this part.
So, unfortunately, from what I recall, you have to knock these guys off your course. How long you get? Like, years and years and years. Like, I think I hit him. I mean, that, that bow hit something. That's just my anger toward him. Is he dead, I hope? No, that's a second sword guy. Right, they're both bow guys, at least. I just kicked a horse, I think. The good news is I feel like they lowered the amount of these idiot samurai at the fight. In this terrible scene that I hated when I played it. What the fuck is this camera? That's a good fucking question, man. That's a good fucking question. I tell ya, I found it easier to jump and shoot arrows. Oh yeah, you don't have to. You don't have to aim. I mean, it's like a circle. This is how you reload them in the fight, by the way. I don't think he had that many arrows in him. But whatever. Did 
Thanks, Muramasa, for the elixirs. Ah, thanks. Here we go. I kind of remember this part. It's a boss of some kind. Oh, yeah, you. mention how much I dislike minions and boss fights. Because I do. minions in a boss fight is infinitely respawning minions in a boss fight. I guess the only thing is that they're healing me. I feel like this is a lot easier than I remember, truthfully. I don't remember those things healing me this whole time. Whoever said jump and arrow, you were absolutely right. This fight was nerfed pretty hard with Sigma. Oh, I feel terrible now. I thought Sigma was actually a lot harder, truthfully. Counter attacks, here we go, so. While blocking. Immediately after blocking them, so we've learned how to parry. Thanks, Doofu. You're the guy. Part of it's just seeing the horse more with widescreen resolution. <laughs> and the mounted samurai was not on fire in the, the vanilla version. I just remember having so much more trouble with this game when I was younger, but I guess part of it is I do kind of know what to... is not on fire, but the man on the horse is on fire. That's correct, yes. So, that's a bunch of bullshit. Um, but at least it got me a chest. that door. Alright, well, fuck the shoji doors then. Oh. Dicks! Guys, the, the whole house is on fire. Do we really want to do this? Oh, 
shit. Watching out for the fire. That, those little weird waves of fire that come out, that part's tricky. Dick. Alright, are we done killing people in this burning head? No, we're not. Now are we done killing people in the burning house? I guess so. Wait, no, that's the wrong way, shit. Hmm? What was that? The game didn't lock up, right? thing on my uh, computer there. Make sure I'm centered kind of correctly and I sort of am. There we go. All right. A dick capture card software. Really high. Okay, let's try that again. I hope they don't make me refight those dudes. Oh, that's nice of them. No, it's um, you. Oh shit, and it's Doku. Asshole kid with three swords and no face. What an asshole. Now, if I remember, this is actually a cutscene boss, but like, I meant to lose this fight. Face Samurai. Oh, that's interesting. If you actually win this fight, you unlock the next difficulty. Hmm. Good night, Brian Horn. So that Doku has presumably killed us, and our village is suddenly now not burning. See what kind of um, what are they gonna say? I am. I am considered. Hey, not bad, right? All right, Ryu's kind of pissed. 
I'm losing that fight, so he's got some sexy boy leather ninja outfit on this time instead of the blue. And if you're saying, how did he get this latex, like, hard plastic Batman kind of ninja My suit? Of ninja have uncovered the reason for the attack. The samurai who burned the village was Doku, lord of the greater fiends of the Vigor Empire. It appears as though the Vigor Emperor seeks the power of the Dark Dragon Blade. Doku. The guy who kicked my ass. So, this really does take place in modern time. No one... No one lied about that in the chat or, or me. Um, we are now going to get on the Vigorian airship. Welcome to Skies of Vengeance, Chapter 3. So let's go kick us. Let's go kick some ass. The Holy Vigorian Empire. Ayani, shut up. Its exclusion as foreign policy makes for very few ways to enter the country. One of the only remaining routes is by airship to the capital city of Tyrone. smaller airship is boarding our airship and it's an elite strike force from the Vigor army led by that guy in his creepy little glasses oh and then that thing is gonna get thrown launched at us he had a chair to launch him out of the blimp Some nice service here, though. You do get a save point right in your room on uh, the Big Orion Blimp Airlines. I just want, I just like the notion, too, that Ryu is wearing his sexy boy ninja outfit and then bought a ticket wearing this with the, I guess, with the sword and the bow and got on. And everybody was cool with that. And also, we can't open a door because we need an ID card. Um, curse, curse, come on the default difficulty. I, I don't know what that is. I'm guessing normal. I don't know. I didn't change it from the... Got it. Oh shit, SWAT guys. They have tasered, well, gun batons, I guess. Maybe why you don't let the ninja on board in the first place. Just a thought. I can't figure out the counter attack system, honestly. No, please don't stab the same guy twice, Ryu. I mean. Second guy there. There we go. All 
right wing key. Let's do it. The wing key brings us up. Ayani. When casting Nympho, shake the controller. Ugh, really? No, let's not do that. Guns just piss me off. I mean, Ryu, if you say, you know, he believes in your Second Amendment rights and all that stuff, don't get me wrong. It's not about owning the gun. It's just about firing it at him. He's a traditional guy. He's like, you know, come on. I fight samurai. I fight ninja magicians. I, this is, I'm not used to this stuff, but I don't know why, why this guy is on board the ship, but here he is. Let's strengthen that. Now we got a stronger dragon sword. We can go back upstairs. Oh crap, used to speed run this game. Wow. It's a force cabin. accidentally pulled the headphone jack out of my headphones. Like nine of those or something to get the extra max health. My best time was 216, which is terrible. Oh, well, I don't know. I mean, sounds better than whatever I'm going to come up with. Uh oh. It's a trap. Guys, I wouldn't. Just imagine the call to the captain. Sir. There is a ninja on board. I, we couldn't do anything. Like, you have to think one of these guys would eventually be like, oh, shit, you know. I mean, this guy is kicking the shit out of me, so I gotta give him props, but... Cool. All right, all right, all right. Yeah, I got it, game. All the locks were deactivated because of malfunction of a primary. <laughs> Got it. Thank you. Yes. Okay. 
How does Ryu know so much about fucking ships suddenly? We have a goddamn Japanese village. That was less, like, menacing than when the door is, like, locked behind you. That looks more like just bad luck. Like, oh, of course, I get off on the wrong floor and I gotta, like... How fucking disrespectful is that, too? You fucking decapitate a guy and then just kick the body away. the second weapon of the game. Dual katana. As far as I know, the dual katana was added in Ninja Gaiden Black. I don't think it was in the original version. Sigma, I'm totally wrong. I'm thinking I'm still liking the single katana, but let's see. D card, we can go back up. I don't remember the Boken. Yeah, I did that before with the hurricane. What a dick! What a dick!
Oh, the bat. That's awesome. How many of these are there? How many fucking guys are there? Christ. I'm actually gonna die on this room. I think that's enough for me for tonight. Thanks for watching, everybody. Have a good night. <laughs>